பிரின்சிபால் ஹெச்ஓடி ஸ்டாஃப் அண்ட் ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் ஐ வெல்கம் எவ்ரிபடி ப்ரெசன்ட் இயர் ப்ரெசன்ட் இயர் த ரிசோர்ஸ் பர்சன் ஆஃப் த டே இஸ் மிஸ்டர் பாபு சங்கர் கணேஷ் ஹி இஸ் ஆல்மோஸ்ட் வெல் நோன் பர்சன் டு த பீப்புள் இன் திருநெல்வேலி ஹி இஸ் த மேனேஜிங் டேரக்டர் ஆஃப் ஈடா டெக் டெக்னாலஜிஸ் திருநெல்வேலி ஹி வாஸ் எக்ஸ்பீரியன்ஸ் ஹி ஹஸ் எக்ஸ்பீ காட் எக்ஸ்பீரியன்ஸ் இன் சிக்ஸ் இயர்ஸ் இன் இன்ஸ்ட்ருமெண்டேஷன் இன் ஸ்பிக் தூத்துக்குடி ஹி ஹி வாஸ் ரன்னிங் த ஆஃப்டர் தட் ஹி ஸ்டார்டட் ஹிஸ் ஈடா டெக்னாலஜி ஹி அ டெக்னிக்கல் ட்ரைனிங் கம்பெனி ஃபார் த பாஸ்ட் டுவெண்ட்டி த்ரீ இயர்ஸ் ஹி இஸ் சக்ஸஸ்ஃபுல்லி ரன்னிங் த கம்பெனி he provides the technological support for complex industry challenges he conducts various training courses such as embedded plc power system power electronics and etc digital image processing in them also he provides various technical solutions to the complex engineering problems that are faced by electrical engineering electrical electronics and each and every department of the engineering colleges as well as polytechnic colleges and uh, to the uh, to me person uh, 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 a person who is personally known to me he is the best generator of ideas uh, uh, his projects worth a lot so with such a resource person we uh, we have got, uh, got to grace the occasion so i, I kindly hand over uh, i hand over the session directly to mr babu sankar ganesh Thank you, sir. Over to you, sir. Thank you. Babu, sir. Babu, sir. Uh, uh, yes, sir. Uh, okay, sir. sir. Over like, to you. Uh, like, take out this class, sir. Thank you. Sir, I, first of all, uh, I thank uh, uh, the professor, Dr. Yepan, sir, and also the management of the uh, University of the College. So, good evening, students. Uh, First, we start uh, a new, some video, uh, see the video, uh, the video represents uh, so many things, okay, okay, pin my ID. Okay, sir. Uh, just a minute, sir. Hello, sir. The presentation is visible, sir. Okay, 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 okay sir. Okay, sir. Uh, can I start the seminar, sir? Yeah, sure. Oh, oh yes sir uh once again once again i sorry for the seven learning students has to generate the idea so generate the idea of uh, a new technology that means of uh, electrical and electronics uh, instruments uh, and electronics uh, gadgets uh. so first of all uh, how to the generate the idea the idea is generated in each and every bodies in surrounding environment and surrounding situation yeah. so first you see your home the home a smart home nowadays are uh, the smart so smartphone technology is uh, widely uh, and uh, so many ideas generated in homemade product you see the homemade electronic gadgets security system surveillance safety system automation iot implementation and uh, 
power management energy auditing so many kind of gadgets available in home system so next generation of smartphone let's generation of smartphone widely echo by the electronic technology the electronic technology occupy 80 percentage of human life so in human life the embedded system the security system the iot technology nano technology robots drones then nano technology so so many next generation technology used or consuming in our life so we have need depth knowledge about this gadget so we discuss about home made industrial made robot made then environment society and defense related gadget we discuss in this session okay one by one we discuss this type of product and how to design the product and how to make the product and how to maintain the product. then home made gadgets are more useful and more available and next generation of smartphone is home made products are widely used then the biomedical also occupy 80 to 90 percent of electronic gadgets in the biomedical field in uh, nowadays uh, the pandemic is very uh, dangerous uh, uh, enormous amount of uh, damage of in our uh, country but that time the electronic product the thermometer this remote thermometer the icu instrument ventilators so many electronic gadgets used in the biomedical field very helpful for pandemic situation so the biomedical technology in electro mechanical then the electro instrument biomedical system that means of glucose monitoring system breath monitoring system icu ecg emg and so many type of electronic products are used to control the very biomedical needs okay so this type of glucose monitoring system the cellular power glucose meter it measures the values of glucose and transmitted to the server that is iot devices so you can uh, access the glucose in any places in the body that by then uh, you can uh, the doctor the diabetes educators in real time clinical data collect from the remote end so in uh, patient monitoring or the patient data or the patient information the patient uh, current situation all the data can be monitored through the instrument the instrument is called biomedical instrument and iot instrument okay so the idea of uh, next generation the biomedical fields are widely used and also the biomedical products are widely used. Okay. then hydroponic system so in hydroponic system it's a fully automated hydroponic system uh, attended in all your plants the need for water feeding and uh, the growth of uh, plant uh, 
then uh, green dosing effect so so many things of uh, hydroponic systems are implemented nowadays for a wide change of agriculture field. so in agriculture field in uh, fast five years the electrical and electronic and iot technology products are 80 to 90 percentage growing in past two years so the hydroponic system of agriculture field also very useful for control the plant then the smartphone based sprinkler control system of irrigation system the irrigation system of agriculture field controlled by the iot device in remote end then you can access or you can monitoring or you can uh, uh, maintain in any places anywhere in the world you can uh, control the irrigation system anywhere in the world you can monitor and control the agriculture department system then smart washing machine you know the smart washing machine your uh, washing machine can control or monitoring in the in your settings or control by your mobile phone and at phone in any places of the world you can uh, uh, enter the home in case of uh, if you want to turn on your washing machine through the mobile phone and also the setting of the washing machine is uh, fully controlled in the smartphone this is available in nowadays so the gadgets are the idea of all the electronic product in available in ideas from the electronic system in a uh, electronic fork you know the electronic phone uh, automatically uh, uh, measure the eating habit of the person. It also alerts the help of indicators for the gentle vibrator for eating of uh, fast eating or uh, uh, more eating or something like this. So the electronic IoT fourth product also uh, available in the market for control the food habit of human. That means of uh, uh, obese uh, human. Then a smart toothbrush, you know, the smart toothbrush, uh, you can press uh, the connected to the uh, Android devices, uh, then it uh, daily it monitoring the hygiene of, you know, your uh, uh, tooth uh, maintenance. Uh. So smart X-ray, the X-ray is uh, used for bridges, the bridges are connected to the IoT device, so the shopper know the egg available or not in the, in the home. In case of the eggs are empty, it automatically delivered to the home, in your home, uh, for uh, supplying of your uh, product. So the IoT system, in the future development of IoT system, all the product are monitoring in your fridge, in the shop. So the shopper can know your fridge availability of product. So that in case of any products are uh, not available, it is applied to the directly to your home by using a parcel man or uh, something uh, salesman or using a drone also supply the product of your home in your uh, uh, flow that means of uh, top of your uh, house. It is also possible for the future uh, development. So, in all type of gadget, in all type of field, agri field, the biomedical field, home and uh, uh, that is what ent ent entertainment and uh, sports uh, and defense, environment, and so many type of things the gadgets are uh, used for uh, uh, communicate and uh, control and maintenance and automatic process of things. A smart AC. A smart AC control app. So this app is used for control, maintain, and power saving of your AC. That means of it automatically detect the person by using the face recognition and activity of motion detection of human. Humans are available or not? The humans are. Uh, sleep or not, before all control systems are, are controlled by the, the smart AC remote system using an app. Then Bluetooth enabled insoles. The insoles are connected to the Bluetooth and uh, a GPS system 
then it automatically track the person uh, and also it uh, measure the walking walking habit and walking distance that the persons are uh, moving or not uh, in all the parameter of human of monitoring in the yeah, bluetooth enabled sensors uh, then the sports in sports point of view the kids that is uh, uh, the ball throw the sensor the ball sensing sensor the velocity of ball uh, throw the sensor all the type of sensors are available in the iot device and also it kind of the app and also the computing computer type of application in this sports also then smart sleep system the smart sleep system it a uh, device uh, it used to for uh, night time for your uh, habit of uh, sleep deep sleep or uh, without uh, disturbing you anything you can monitoring the smart sleep system so so many things are uh, so many gadgets are available in the market uh, for uh, different type of applications yeah so how to make the product how to make the product and how to generate or how to fabricate in your product in your own design so i explained that uh, product how to make your uh, product by using your uh, knowledge and using your uh, things okay so dear students uh, you, you know how the technologies is going the technologies are used in uh, industry and the medical field and home field and so many types uh, type of field i used to for different type of applications are available in the market and also in the next generation of system so you must know the idea and also how do it make so it's very important so we discuss about how to generate or make the product in your own design okay uh, uh students ivana uh, enna solla varanga endu ungalku okay va ma understand agada yaradhu idha patti idha sollama இப்போ நம்ம என்ன டிஸ்கஸ் பண்ணிட்டு இருந்தோம் நம்ம என்ன பண்றோம் நம்ம என்ன சொல்றோம் அப்படிங்கிறது உங்களுக்கு ஓகேவா சொல்லுங்க சார் Sir, I think, sir, uh, for in my side, the screen is not visible, sir. I think maybe problem from my end or I'm not sure. Sir, not a, uh, audio is not clear. Please tell me. No, no, screen is not uh, visible at my end, sir. I am not sure if it's my problem or with all faculty, all the participants are facing the same. Hello? 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 from my and other participants here yeah. uh everybody oh. yes yeah yes sir yes sir yes sir yes sir now i stop the screen is the not screen. visible sir yeah yes excuse me sir uh, yes sir uh, i am stop the screen sir yeah okay sir okay sir. yes sir thank you sir i will the can you sir
Okay. Uh. Ah, yes, sir. Sir, uh, the percentage is visible, sir. Uh, yes, sir. Oh, if it is not visible, sir. Sir, it's visible, sir. Yes, sir. It's visible, sir. Ah, yeah. Okay. Sir, first of all, I explain the drone. The Arduino drone, that is a drone controlled by the embedded system. That is a BLDC motors, BLDC drives, and embedded control system is how to control the drone. So, in drone control system, five component. Sensor component, drive component, component component, communication component, navigation component. So in sensor component, aeroscope, limb sensor, GPS, so many things, accelerometer, many sensor. And driving part, DLDC motor, high speed DLDC motor, then DLDC drive, so are used for power devices. And the main processor, CPU processor or Arduino board or Nano board or uh, Raspberry Pi or Blackberry something. Like then the power banks also used to for supply the power to the all the component. Then communication part we are using RF communication or RAM communication or Wi-Fi communication or ZB communication or Bluetooth or Wi-Fi communications are used to for communicate between the drone to control system. So in a drone you can make a drone. The drone has five parts, sensing part, driving part, embedded part, communication part. So these parts are used for control the drone. Yeah. So the Arduino based drone control system or any I processor based drone control system, you can make it. It is very useful for different type of applications. Then X pad robots. In X pad robot, it's operated by the embedded system and servo motors. Servo motor for controlling the six type of uh, legs individually, the program by the uh, embedded system. So the embedded system sensors are available in the X robot. It controls the six robot by the exact movement of the robot system. In the robot system, the servo motors are uh, controlled forward and reverse direction of the depend upon the sequence of the, uh, our algorithms. So the algorithm control the robot can and control the robot uh, unit. So X robot we can make it it's possible for making a robot X robot X of X robot for uh, operating different type of applications. Then Arduino robot arm. Um, in Arduino robot arm, it has six motors, that motor is a base motor, then soldier motor, arm, wrist motor, arm motor and the gripper motor. So six motors are used for uh, robotic operation. Then the robot car also used for control the vehicles, that is a metal detecting vehicle, uh, bomb detecting vehicle, so many vehicles, the robot cars are used. The robot car we are using a motor, like motor is a DC motor. And the motor is operated by the driver, there is motor driver, chopper control driver or uh, uh, DC motor, uh, real DC motor driver, so many things are used for control the robot of uh, vehicles also. So, in the mechatronic project, the drones are used for control the real DC motor, the X robots are controlled for uh, servo motor. The robotic arms are used for shepherd motor. The electric cars operate by the DC motor. 
So what is the difference between the uh, different applications? Yeah, different application. The electrical engineering uh, has a, a support of uh, different type of uh, motors are available in different applications. You know, so the high speed, high power, less weight application. The drone used high speed PLDC motor. So the motor speed is around uh, uh, 5,000 to 10,000 RPM. So the high speed DLDC motor is designed. It support for uh, high torque and high volume of air, producing a high volume of air for flying the drone. Uh, but in uh, exapad robot, it is need for high torque but low speed, uh, but controlling effect. The controlling effect means the robot is uh, controlled in uh, degree by degree using a servo motor. The servo motor also controls the PAE controller, the PED controller, the PC controller. So that you can control your motor intelligent control system using intelligent control system, you can control the exam motor by using the servo motor. So you can make it robot, uh, you purchase servo motor for high torque and high, high torque and uh, uh, low speed. Then control degree is also very effective using servo motor. But in robotic operation, the robot are controlled by the stepper motor. So in a robot arm, there are six number of motors are used. Base motor, that is stepper motor. Uh, two phase or four phase stepper motor, or sometimes uh, five phase stepper motors are used for robotic controlling of arm. In gripper, wrist, soldier, base. So five applications, five axes are controlled in by the stepper motor. The stepper motor is uh, high torque, then degree is very, very, very minute. There is a, you can adjust the robot in uh, mm to centimeter. You can only, for controlling the stepper motor only, you can control the robotic arm. So in robotic arm operation, the stepper motors are widely used for control the robotic arm. But in high speed operation, high torque operation, and also uh, controlling of torque, you must using of uh, DC motor, DC sun motor or DC BM DC motor or uh, BM DC motor used for electric vehicle for controlling the vehicle control system. So the robotic control a different type of mechanical access. We are using different type of motors and different type of control systems. Okay. So communication system. What are the communication system used for uh, control the mechatronic devices? First one is Bluetooth, then Wi-Fi, then RF communication, radio frequency communication. So in radio communication, communication long distance, you, can, you want to long distance for controlling the electric vehicle or any drone, you can using a RF communication or GAM communication. The GAM communication is widely used for long distance, like uh, 10 kilometers surrounding the automatic drone control system or automatic flying uh, uh, airport. So all the type of uh, robot, uh, play, flying drone is controlled by the ham communication system. Uh, in Bluetooth communication system, we are using or control the uh, stepper motor, robotic arm, miniature uh, robotic cars are used for Wi-Fi communication system. In Bluetooth communication system, it's used for uh, com uh, communicate the wheelchair, robotic wheelchair or uh, handicapped wheelchairs are controlled by the Bluetooth communication system. So in uh, four type of communication system nowadays used for communicate the robotic or uh, wheelchair or electric vehicle. First one is Bluetooth, the second one is Wi-Fi, third one is RF, fourth one is Zigbee, fifth one is AM communication for long distance, it's a short wave communication. In communication, the wide range of frequencies are used for uh, different type of application, different type of communication. Uh, in case of uh, we are using Bluetooth or uh, Wi-Fi, uh, the communication frequency is 2.4 gigahertz like this. In GAN communication, the communication uh, uh, wireless uh, RF range is uh, 24 megahertz. It's a short wave range. The bandwidth is short wave. My HAM communication is widely used for drone applications. Then, in smartphone control system, it control the electrical power. In electrical power, controlled by the app. How to control the electrical power using the Android app? Simple. 
the switchboard that means of then power devices are connected and by the five component the arduino board the ac to ac converter the relay module and bluetooth module the bluetooth modules are connected directly connected to the mobile lab using the bluetooth device the bluetooth device are connected to the arduino then arduino control the relay the relay operate the power socket so in your home you can control your uh, home appliances using the component by component only uh, hc05 hc05 is a bluetooth model that model easily connected your uh, bluetooth device for accessing of your home electrical loads by using the and our app the and apps are made by your own design Uh, that means of uh, in this model we are doing uh, design of two type of uh, loads are uh, controlled individually on and off button using on and off button you can control your home uh, power uh, output and also control your light fan switches switch washing machine so on so on. so already i tell tell that uh, you can control your washing machine or control your fridge or control your uh, home appliances using the device how to control first one communication device second one embedded system third one relay control module fourth power supply that means of dc to dc converter so first communication module second embedded system control system third one interface system or uh, relay unit then power supply so these units are control the home appliances through the app maybe in futurely feature in home all the switches are control your uh, mobile this called mobi switch mobi switch are available in the next generation so the mobi switch also used for the next generation of control system right to many for that then i i explain the how to control the gesture control of uh, robot vehicle the gesture control of robot vehicle you can make the gesture that is control your gesture the the vehicle can be move forward or reverse left or right like this and how to control the hand grip as uh, glove glove as uh, connected with the embedded system why be modern ah sir tell me सर वन मिनट आ ओके सर सर see uh, see my presentation sir ah uh, yeah sir that is arduino gesture control pbd sir yeah ah uh, yeah yeah yes sir okay thank you sir okay sir i continue so in case of uh, glow control uh, robotic system or glow control uh, wheelchair or glow control robotic system is operated by the two unit one unit one unit is gesture uh, arrangement and other unit uh, vehicle arrangement vehicle arrangement unit in gesture control system uh, the it has uh, mem sensor that is actuometer sensors are provided in the glove and connected to the uh, nano board and node mcu so the you can uh, move your hand then uh, my Mem sensor. There is a actual meter sense the X Y direction of your hand. You can rotate your hand. The X Y is at the mem sensor. It, it sends and it automatically it connected to the Arduino nano board. The nano board is land is movement of your gesture. Uh, using the X Y sensor analog signal is converted to digital and it is a form of a pattern. The patterns are recognized by the Arduino internal program of ML program, the machine learning program. The machine learning program is a uh, landing of your uh, hand gesture movement. so you can uh, control the vehicle through the your gesture to the node mcu the node mcu are connected to the remote end of your uh, vehicle or robot 
so the data is sharing of uh, other end of your uh, robotic arm or a robotic uh, wheelchair or robotic uh, car uh, in that uh, remote end the car in it as uh, arduino board the arduino board they receive the signal from the uh, node mcu and uh, connected to the training unit of motor so the motor is operate uh, it will move the front and back of your vehicle so here the movement of wheel is controlled by the driver unit driver unit of uh, lm298 and yeah. n298 is a driving of dc motor for controlling your forward reverse direction of vehicle so the 293 is a connected to the arduino board the arduino board is connected to the node mc the node unit command from the glove so the you can shaking of a movement of your glove the vehicles are move forward or left move forward or reverse or left or right like this so the small gadget is control <coughs> your movement of hand by using gesture control system then color setter unit so color setter unit of, uh, it automatically detect the color color of each object and it is mostly used for robotic detection there is no robotic unit the robot know the color of object in case of the, uh, you want to take the yellow color of uh, object it automatically come and detect the yellow color of object and it pick up and uh, send to you for a uh, robotic intelligent control system then wire bending machine that is wire bending machine is used for uh, control of uh, length of wire and also bending of wire so you see the picture in electronic uh, wire bending machine uh, in a used for automatic system and also not uh, manual it automatic fully automatic and uh, it has five unit straightener unit feeder unit z axis bender and control board in straightener unit uh, only the wire ropes are straightened and the feeder section used to for feed the road uh, feed the rod the bending unit are used to for bend the wire so this process is controlled by the arduino board in under the under of the table the arduino boards are connected it control the movement of each and every process of mechanical movement first of all in this section three type of motors are used first is stepper motor then bending stepper motor then third feed stepper motor so feed stepper motor used for z axis purpose so in z axis purpose the feed stepper motor are used for pull the wire and feed to the bending of stepper motor so the bending stepper motor used for uh, rotate the 90 degree of uh, rotation of gear movement and it uh, automatically bend the wire system so a yeah, small bending system used for control the full automatic system then rfid access control system so rfid access control system means you can control or open or close in your door using the access control system of rfid so you can uh, enter your uh, home or enter your uh, any atm system so first you go insert the rfid card then the rfid card read the data from the card and it check the card members are authenticated person or another authenticated person and it uh, send the data to the processor the processor sends the human or uh, allowed or not then it direct and it send to control to the motor the motor operate the door and door is open so that uh, the system is used to for security purpose of all atms or banks or any, anything can use this uh, control system uh, then uh, how to program how to program in a controller that is of uh, a small controller that is of arduino controller how to program first of all you can make any gadgets you can make any gadget uh, the simple gadgets are arduino board the arduino boards are uh, used for uh, different type of application the different type of uh, a gadget you can uh, easily control easily program the program and also the softwares and libraries are available in net so you can easily access to control the any process electrical mechanical electromechanical 
electronics, communication. So, so many things are controlled by the Arduino board. In Arduino board, I just explained two minutes for uh, what are the parts of uh, Arduino board and what are the devices are in Arduino board. So, the Arduino board has uh, main is uh, the microcontroller that is Atmaga 38B, the 28 pin microcontroller, 8 pin microcontroller used to for control the whole process of Arduino board. In Arduino, I is called Arduino is a company, the company can produce of a board only. The board only you can produce, the, but the ICs of Atmaga 38B is our uh, Atmel controller. Uh, this uh, Admel, uh, Admega main processor has uh, 28 pin, uh, it has uh, 13 GPU IOs and uh, 6 analog pins. So, digital IOs are this, uh, you see this uh, 0 to 13 are digital IOs and uh, 6 analog input, you see, these are analog input, A0 to A5. So, the 13 are digital connection system. Then. Serial communication port. So, 0 1 sir, serial communication, DX or X. Uh, you can send the data to UART from the GSM modem, GPS modem, Wi Fi modem. So many things are connected between the Arduino board to communication device. We are using 0 sense ones or 2 or 3. The 0 sense are uh, uh, software control uh, system are uh, uh, 2 and 3. The hardware communication port are 0 1. So, 0 1 sir, hardwarely connected to Arduino. So, the speed of the communication is very high from high apart from software system. Then the Arduino board is operated only 3.3 volt DC only. That way, we can use a regulator. The regulator is 317. The 317 regulator regulate the 3.3 volt constantly to supply to the Atmaga microcontroller. The ESP port is connected to the UART, then you can download the program in the Admaga controller to the ESP port. So the Admaga, make Admaga board, the Admaga controller easily access the program connected to system. In system, the Arduino IDE install and easily download the program to the Admaga controller. So in Admaga controller, very easy easy accessing of uh, uh, beginner uh, beginner uh, developer and uh, you can make your gadget a very useful device of main processing control system of in our system. So this uh, Arduino controller program is very simple. I explain a small program for uh, how to develop the control. First of all, the Arduino uh, IDE is uh, readily available in the net. You can just uh, open source, uh, uh, download the Arduino software in your uh, laptop. So you can easily access the Arduino program. The Arduino program is written by the script languages. The languages are uh, only C program only. So, what are the steps are going for uh, making of uh, Dino based project? First step is circuit making, then second step is uh, uh, loading of code, then third step is you can make uh, debug the circuits. For making of circuit, you can, uh, uh, the program is connected to the Arduino, the program download to the Arduino. First of all, you can check the Arduino board is working or not uh, using a LED system. There is a blinking LED system in my 13 pins of Arduino you know boards. So you can e easily uh, know if the program is downloaded or not. The board is working or not. You can easily access for uh, downloading the big bringing program of your Arduino. So check the board is working or not. So uh, uh, using Arduino IDE, IDE means integrated development environment. You can make the IC uh, need for developing of environment system. So you install Arduino IDE for your laptop or any PC. So the environment ready to download the program. So it converted into C to hexadecimal. You can write your program in the C language in Arduino. The Arduino is used for, the Arduino is a compiler. The compiler is converted into C into X. The X data is downloaded directly to the IC memory. Memory means your Atmega microcontroller permanent memory. That is a E prop. So the program is stored in E from the program executed and run the output of GPIOs. 
So you can make the program. First of all, uh, you write the program in the Arduino. It has uh, five steps are there. You can write the Arduino program in five steps. First one is include of libraries. If you need a special function, that is DSM function or any uh, GPS function or any LCD function or any communication devices function or any sensor function or any special function, you can uh, must you can add input files. So first you can write your program in the Arduino IDE, you, write, you can include libraries first. Then second one is setups. In setup means in case of you are using serial communication or you can using a, a PWO communication, first of all you can install setup setup function, you can install uh, uh, what type of setup you are using, what type of port you are using, what type of function you are using, you just uh, set up the setup function, you can uh, declare the setup of what type of function you are using. In case of you are using GPIOs, that means of uh, uh, input output port, uh, you can uh, must uh, set up this uh, section, okay. So in case of uh, uh, you, you using uh, input of uh, four inputs or you, you using four input, you must declare the pin number, then what uh, direction of uh, pin you are using. So you must uh, declare the setup section. In that declaration, you need declaration. Some type of, you, if you want to you, uh, declare individual, float, array. So declaration is must. That is declaration must. Fourth one is functions. Sometimes you want to use a keypad or any special function, you declare functions also, you can declare. Then fifth one is loop. Loop is main program. You write the main program in the Arduino, Arduino controller. Loop program is a main controller. If you want to uh, write any applications, any application or any main processor or uh, write in the loop section only. In the loop section, only four category of installation is needed. First one is, if you want to send the data to the GPIO, you must write digital write or digital read. In case of, if you want to control the output of water, you just uh, write a digital write pin number, then output is right. So it is an example. We want to turn on the LED. That is means of uh, output LED. If you want to uh, on the motor, if you want to off the motor, you assign the pin 10. Then the command is pin mode 10 output. Pin mode 10 output. You will declare you can declaration of pin output and declare the output pin is low or high. So what's the command? So digital write 10 high. If you want to turn off the motor, digital write 10 low. So a simple command, uh, passing of uh, Arduino, you can control motor, you can control shorter, you can control circuit breaker, or you can control any output devices with the single command. The command is digital write. 10 is pin number, high is the output is on. Digital rate 10, low. The output is off. So a simple command used for Arduino for controlling of electrical motor or electrical control system or relay or breaker, anyone. Uh, Zolnad valve, so many things are controlled by the Arduino. Digital write read command. If you want to uh, switch on the motor, you can read the switch using digital read command. The simple command for write and read the motor. Then delay. Delay is essential for uh, on delay purpose, off delay purpose, then sequential purpose, then creating frequency. So, so many type of uh, application, so many type of uh, uh, project you need for delay function. Delay function important for controlling the output devices of gadgets. Okay. So, the Arduino system used for 
control the output of water. Okay, uh, see, I explain simple logical program. That means of uh, blinking of LED. The main code for blinking a LED. The program has a wide setup. So you can set up pin mode. So you, first you are setting uh, uh, 13 pins are output. Pin mode, 13 output. Pin mode means 13 pin output. Then the loop has digital write, 13 is high. Then delay, then waiting of on time. Then delay, 13 is low. Then delay, 1000. That is half time. Half delay. First is on delay, second is half delay. So, simple program for uh, blinking of LEDs. So how to download the program in the Arduino? Very simple. Uh, all of you know. Uh, first of all, uh, you can uh, connect the uh, programmer and just uh, click the arrow button. That is a uh, is a uh, the click the uh, uploading arrow button. You download the X file. X file of your uh, Arduino is uh, X files are download in the Arduino board. Open board. Okay. So. Um, I, I explained how to download the program, how to download the program in the Arduino board, how to download the code in the Arduino board, I will explain. So, once, once again I will explain. Making of program. Making of gadget, making of different ideas. So different ideas can making and creating and implementation. It's a main process of next generation. Yeah. So you first land circuit diagram, then second program, and third result verification. That is analysis. So three important parts are available in the making of ideas. Okay. Okay, students. If you want to explain one more thing, now, when you project, la, illa when you are thinking about it, you have a product or matter, no thing, na. And the product or matter, that we, we have to learn what is it. Our model step, what is it? Have you seen it? Gadget the Uruaka the Ki, Namuka idea. So, on the idea of the Yepudi Uruaka. So, Namodia environmental and the Pudia, Sulla, the Pudia, La Pontri, the Machakoni Pato. So, Namapaka Pudia and the system on the home are clam, medical are clam, defense are clam, other than the environment are clam, they love handing up to the Pudia is a mark clam. So, in the environment, let the Pudia visit the Namapatalum, and the visit the Kitavia and a Pola Uruak, Pola Kitavia and a Sulani and a Uruak in the idea of creation of the process of Maratio. So, the idea of the Niki Pater Grappa, Arau Teve Ripina, and the Teve can end up Panamudio, electronic lay, electronic lay, electrical lay, and the Teve of the Salpa to get up Panamudio in the Pakro. So, on the Teve Uruak, the poor gadget and Uruak. So, the number of handy up to go leg movement on the tap the Abdina, the leg movement of Uruak Razakan, a menace for all. And the leg movement of Uruak Razakan, a mena panano. Upon the leg with the Tavian, a mechanical system, a Tavian a motor, a Tavian a control, a Tavian a logic, a Tavian a program, a Tavian a communication system. Alame on the number the device level there, connect Pandi, Adamulama, and the gadget of Uruak Razakan, number on the idea creation. So, if you want to see what we are doing, we will tell you about the embedded system. We will tell you about the embedded system. There are big microcontrollers, admiral microcontrollers, Arduino board, then Blackberry board, then processor, then AI system, fuzzy system, artificial intelligence. There are boards available. So now, if you first of all, when the beginner are coming, you have to explain to them that this board is not used for the beginner. We have a DSP processor, AI boards, and Raspberry Pi boards, and many higher-end boards. We have to use for the gadget. But when you are beginning, you have to use the Raspberry Pi Python code. You have to use the Python code. You have to use the Python code. 
இருந்தாலும் ஒரு சின்னதா நம்ம ஒரு கேஜெட் உருவாக்கி பாக்கணும் எனக்கு ஒரு கான்ஃபிடென்ட்காக நான் சிம்பிளா பண்ணணும் அப்படின்னா நான் எக்ஸ்பிளைன் பண்ண அந்த அரிதோ போல யூஸ் பண்ணி நீங்க ஒரு சின்ன கேஜெட் உருவாக்கிக்கலாம் இந்த கேஜெட்டை உருவாக்குறதுக்கு ஃபர்ஸ்ட் நீங்க சர்க்கியூட் மேக் பண்ணுங்க சர்க்கியூட் மேக் பண்றதுக்கு நீங்க டிசைனிங் சாஃப்ட்வேர் பிசிபி டிசைனிங் சாஃப்ட்வேர் லேர்ன் பண்ணிக்கோங்க அந்த பிசிபி டிசைனிங் சாஃப்ட்வேர் நமக்கு நெட்ல இசி பிசி எக்ஸ்பிரஸ் பிசிபி ஆர் கார்டு சொல்லிட்டு நிறைய பிசிபி அவைலபிளா இருக்குது அந்த பிசிபி டிசைனிங் சாஃப்ட்வேர் மூலமா நீங்க உங்களுடைய சர்க்கியூட்டுடைய டிசைனிங் வந்து நீங்க பண்ணிக்கலாம் அந்த கத்துக்கலாம் அது மூலமா நீங்க உங்களுடைய சர்க்கியூட்டை வந்து நீங்க மேக் பண்ணிக்கலாம் பிசிபி உருவாக்கிக்கலாம் அந்த பிசிபி வந்து நீங்க மறுபடியும் என்ன பண்ணலாம் அப்படின்னா ஒரு ப்ராடக்டா மாத்துறதுக்கு அதுக்கு எம்பட சிஸ்டத்துக்கு ப்ரோக்ராமிங் நீங்க லேர்ன் பண்ணணும் அந்த ப்ரோக்ராமிங் மூலமா தான் உங்களுடைய கிட்ஸ் வந்து நீங்க ரெடி பண்ணிக்கிடுவீங்க அந்த கிட்ல நீங்க ப்ரோக்ராம் பண்றதுக்கு நீங்க எம்பட போர்ட்ஸ் நீங்க சரி பண்ணணும் அந்த எம்பட போர்ட் தான் இப்போதைக்கு நீங்க ரெடிமேடா அவைலபிளா இருக்கக்கூடிய நானோ இனோ மெகா லில்லி ராஸ்பெரி தென் பிளாக்பெரி அண்ட் ஏஐ போர்ட் அண்ட் இன்டெலிஜென்ட் போர்ட்ஸ் இந்த மாதிரியான போர்ட்ஸ் நமக்கு ரெடிமேடா கிடைக்குது இது உங்களுக்கு தேவையை பொறுத்து உங்களுடைய ப்ராசஸ் பொறுத்து உங்களுடைய கேஜெட்டை பொறுத்து உங்களுடைய இன்ட்ரெஸ்ட பொறுத்து நீங்க உங்களுடைய எம்பட டெவலப்பரா மாறணும் அப்படின்னீங்கன்னா இந்த சிஸ்டத்துல உங்களுடைய நாலேஜ் நீங்க வளர்த்துக்கலாம் ஆனா நீங்க என்ன போர்டு நீங்க நாலேஜ் டெவலப் பண்ணணும்னு நினைச்சாலும் பேசிக்கா உங்களுக்கு ஒரு ஐடியா வந்து தெளிவா இருக்கணும் அந்த ஐடியா தெளிவா இருக்கணும் அப்படின்னா நீங்க சின்ன சின்ன கேஜெட் நீங்களே டெவலப் பண்ணி அந்த கேஜெட் மூலமா இந்த ஐடியாவை நீங்க லேர்ன் பண்ணிக்கிட்டீங்கன்னா உங்களால ஒரு ரெண்டு எம்பட டெவலப்பரா மாற முடியும் அதே மாதிரி உங்களுக்கு எம்பட டெவலப்பராக வந்ததுக்கு அப்புறம் நீங்க இந்த ஒரு ப்ராடக்டை மேக் பண்ணி இந்த ப்ராடக்ட் மேக் பண்றது மூலமா உங்களுக்கு வந்து சமுதாயத்தில் இருக்கக்கூடிய மக்களுக்கு உங்களால வந்து இந்த கேஜெட் மூலமா ஒரு நன்மையை நம்மளால பண்ண முடியும் அப்படின்னா கண்டிப்பா நம்ம இந்த ஆரண்டியை பண்ணி நம்ம எல்லாத்துக்கும் நம்மளுடைய நன்மையை வந்து நம்ம தெரிவிச்சுக்க முடியும் ஸோ என்ன பொறுத்த வரைக்கும் ஒரு எலக்ட்ரிக்கல் இன்ஜினியர் சொல்றவங்க கண்டிப்பா இன்னைக்கு நம்ம சமுதாயத்துல வந்து நிறைய பாசிட்டிவான விஷயத்துக்கு நம்ம சப்போர்ட் பண்ணிட்டு இருக்கிறோம் நம்மளுடைய எலக்ட்ரிக்கல் சிஸ்டத்தை யூஸ் பண்ணி தான் இன்னைக்கு எல்லா சிஸ்டமும் இன்னைக்கு இயங்கிட்டு இருக்குது ஸோ இந்த எல்லா இயக்கமும் ஒரு சின்ன ஒரு ஒரு கேஜெட் மூலமா தான் அந்த டெவலப் ஆகி இன்னைக்கு இவ்வளவு பெரிய கேஜெட்ஸ் தான் நமக்கு டெவலப் ஆகி இருக்கு ஸோ இது எல்லாத்துக்கும் காரணமான எலக்ட்ரிக்கல் இன்ஜினியர்ஸுக்கு வந்து ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டி அதுக்கு தேவையான சூழல் அதுக்கு தேவையான செயல்படுத்தி செமினார் உங்களுக்கு யூஸ்ஃபுல்லா இருக்கும்னு நினைக்கிறேன் இது ஒரு சின்ன ஒரு பிகினிங் தான் இது உங்களுக்கு ஒரு சின்ன ஒரு பொடி தான் இதை வந்து இன்னும் இதுல நிறைய விஷயங்கள் நிறைய டிஸ்கஷன் நிறைய கான்செப்ட் நம்ம டிஸ்கஸ் பண்ணலாம் செமினாரோட டைம் ரொம்ப ஷார்ட்டா இருக்கிறதுனால நம்ம இதை இது சம்பந்தமா உங்களுக்கு எதுவும் டவுட் இருந்தா நீங்க ஐயப்பன் சாரை காண்டக்ட் பண்ணுங்க அது மூலமா நம்ம உங்களுக்கு என்ன சப்போர்ட் பண்ண முடியுமோ நம்ம அதை பண்ணிக்கலாம் தேங்க்யூ ஸ்டூடெண்ட் தேங்க்யூ சார் தேங்க்யூ சார் I propose the vote of thanks on behalf of St. Mother Teresa Engineering College, Management, Principal, HOD, Staff and Students. I thank Mr. Babu Sankar Ganesh who organized the event in an excellent manner. I also thank all the participants who have spared their time to attend this event. So I am very much thankful to each and everybody who made this event a success. Thank you so much. participants i am now posting the certificate link in the chat box you can get the certificate by filling up this form thank you so much i have till all of you leave i will i will be till all of you leave i will be in this in this call and you just click this link and submit the feedback form submit the feedback form and get your certificate okay thank you thank you sir thank you sir. thank you sir thank you thank you so much sir சார் ரெகுலேஷன் கோடு என்ன ரெகுலேஷன் கோடு சார் இருக்கு பேட்ச் இயர் கடுத்து பேட்ச் இயர் கடுத்து இருக்கு